Welcome back to another Hustle is Fitness 10 minute workout. Today we have a slow and controlled weightlifting workout. We're gonna be doing an ATP style, which means that we're gonna go upper body, then lower left body, so that blood really has to work to move from our upper to our lower and then back up. So we've got 10 minutes on the clock. I've got my light, medium, and heavy weights. All right, let's get to it. Grabbing my medium weights here, we're gonna do 90 degree shoulder rotations. So, making that arm to do a 90 degree. We're gonna open, we're gonna close. We're gonna open, we're gonna close. Starting on the right side here, core engaged, chest open, making sure that that rotation in the arm goes all the way out to the side and comes back to the front. Good. So all of these exercises today, we are going to make sure that we stay here until we feel this burn. If that means you need to up the weight, please go for it. If it means you need to drop it because you went too heavy in the first place, that's fine too. So we are slow and controlled. A lot of these 10 minute workouts feel like we're jumping around, we're getting through it because we only have 10 minutes, right? Well, sometimes we need to slow it down. Let's switch to that left side. Good. I feel that right here in the front of my shoulder, actually. Right where we should be. Good. Great. This is a great workout. If you're trying not to get super sweaty, so maybe in the middle of your work day, maybe right before bed, right when you wake up. Just making sure those muscles are burning, getting that exercise in without having to jump around a ton. Good. In five, four, three, two, and one. Good. Holding on to just one of those weights. We're going to do a reverse lunge, and on the side that stays out in front, we're going to do a twist. So let's do start with the left leg stepping back in three, two, one left. Twist to the right, stand it back up, good. Left, twist to the right, good. Awesome. If the balance is challenged here, drop the weight if you need it, or don't go down as far in your lunge. Good. Chest is up, legs are burning, and we're breathing. Awesome. What a nice change from go, go, go and not some of the other workouts. Good, let's switch sides. So right leg goes back and we're twisting to the left. Awesome. Breathe. Remember at the end of every workout, we have a 60 second challenge. Same with today, nothing new here. Breathe. Good. Where's your mind at right now? Are you in this workout? Are you somewhere in your work, at your desk? Are you thinking about your kids? Let's bring it back to you. Good. One more. Good. All right, hammer curls with a three, one, three count. What that means, it's a tempo. So one, two, three, one count at the top, one, two, three, on the way down. Here we go. One, two, three, pause. One, two, three. This will make them burn. One, two, three. One, two, three. It's so easy to fling them around, use momentum, and you have to slow it down. It really challenges the muscles. Good. One, two, three, breathe. One, two, three. Good. One, two, three. One, two, three. Awesome. One, two, three. Good. One, two, three. You can do this all day. One, two, three. One, two, three. Great. A couple more here. One, two, three. One, two, three. Let's do one more. One, two, three. One, two, three. Awesome. Drop those weights, kneeling hip thrusts. What a fun, not awkward at all, movement. <laughs> so toes together, knees apart. Let's grab a medium weight here. Keep it up at the chest. We're gonna sit those boots back, pop them up, squeeze at the top. Ready? Let's get it. 
So this is really gonna work those glutes as well as the quads. Sit those feet back, pop them up, lower abs, engage. Good, push. Remember, I am 19 weeks pregnant here, so don't compare your movement to mine. So you're pushing. Good, this move always gets the glutes nice and sore. It works up. Good, if you need to drop that weight, please do so. Squeeze, those glutes should be pushing your body up. That is what is working to move here. Nice cottage cheese butt, shouldn't look super pretty, should be squeezed nice and tight. Good, inner thighs are working. And we're breathing. Give me two more. Up, down, up. Awesome. Whew, legs burning. All right, overhead press. Same thing, 313 tempo. I've got my medium weights here. Here we go. One, two, three. One, two, three. Good. One, two, three. One, two, three. Good. Push those shoulders down. Go post arms. One, two, three. Good. One, two, three. When your arms come up, your shoulders should be coming up too. They should still be staying pressed down. Good. One, two, three. One, two, three. One, two, three. One, two, three. Crazy what happens when you move, slow things down, isn't it? It's like all of a sudden you feel things can't just block them out. Good. One, two, three. One, two, three. One, two, three. One more. One, two, three. One, two, three. Good. Grab your heavy weights. We're going into a straight leg deadlift. So feet pointing forward, weights at your sides to start. Then we're gonna bring them in front of the body, push the hips back. Stand up, squeeze the glutes. I'll show you from the side here. Push the hips back. Stand up, squeeze the glutes. Keep that chin tucked in to protect that back. Good. So you should feel this in your hamstrings and your glutes, but you will also feel it in your low back because that's where the glutes are connected to. So don't worry too much if you are feeling it there. Good, stand up, squeeze. Can't go down as far as I used to be able to. They got this belly in the way. So right, I'm gonna go half shin and then stand up. I used to be able to go all the way down to the toes. What the hey? Stand up, squeeze. Good. Stand up, squeeze. Breathe. Five seconds left here. And drop those heavy weights. Let's grab your medium weights. We're gonna do an overhead tricep extension. We'll grab one at a time. Starting with it in your right hand. Bring that weight back. We're gonna do a 90 degree here. We're gonna just bring the weight up and back down. So this part of your arm should not be moving. Let's tuck that pelvis under, protect our low back, engage the core. Good. This is going to be working the underside of that tricep where a lot of people will like to complain or not like that flabby arm. That's where this is gonna target. Good, push through. All right, let's switch sides. We've got 15 seconds left here before we go into our 60 second squat hold. The finally, finally, the final 60 seconds of this workout. Good, five, four, three, two, and one. All right, let's sit into it. Toes pointing forward. Sit down, chest up. Let's get it. Here we go. We're here for 50 more seconds. Chest is up. Tilt, tilt, tilt that pelvis under. Support yourself with those hamstrings and those glutes. Can you get a little lower? Good. Chest, hands out in front of you. Down on your legs, right here. Keep that chest up. And breathe. Over halfway, 
little bit lower. Come on. This is a challenge. Get through it. Make that mental shift. Change your day. Come on. Breathe. We've got 10 seconds left. Come on, I'll count it down. Five, four, three, two, one. Stand it up. There's that beep. Turn the clock off here. Nice work, you guys. You did it. 10 minutes, slow and controlled. Our bodies are fired up. Do you feel that fire? I feel such a shift from that workout. Sometimes you don't need to do all the jumping. That was amazing. Thank you so much for joining me. As always, info at hustlelessfitness.com or hustle underscore listfitness on Instagram if you have any questions or if there's any kind of workouts you want to see right here on this channel. Thank you guys so much. Have a great day.